Okay, so uh, Luffy may have just started a war. I'm going to be honest. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to the channel. My name is Jack the Boss for I Shinobi. We have episodes 397 and 398 of our One Piece watcher today. Now, yeah, the last one, dude, I don't know. It's, it's about to pop off. You can just feel it. We found out the Navy plans to execute Ace, and that's going to start an entire war with Whitebeard that they're guessing. And I, I, once again, I'm guessing that that's, that's why this section on Crunchyroll is called Summit War. But on the flip side of things, we might have just started one here in the archipelago because Luffy just punched a celestial dragon someone that a random citizen let alone a pirate shouldn't even breathe in the wrong direction towards i'm very scared i'm very excited very nervous everything we're gonna hop right into it if you're new to the channel drop us up and hit that big boy bell let's get started i do like that they do these though it kind of uh sets the stage reminds you of what all of this is about all their bounty posters even Sanji's. They have to get it updated eventually, right? No one would even recognize Bork because he's a skeleton now. Oh, that's such a cool shot. Recap. Oh, we'll watch the recap of this one. It's okay. I do kind of want to see the punch again anyways. Celestial Dragon is way too cool of a name for who these people are and how ego and trash they are. Like Celestial Dragon just sounds so beautiful. God damn. That goes so hard, man. Oh my gosh. I genuinely hope that just killed him. Like, actually. What do the other uh, celestial dragons think, too? Oh, gosh. Now what? Now what? Bro, Loki, some of them are probably like, ah, nice. Hell yeah. Heck that guy. Oh my gosh, the fist mark. And they all stand by their captain. Zoro is prepped and ready, baby. Now what happens? How do the other two celestial dragons react? The thing is, there isn't really powerful opposition here. And they even said there's not many Marines. So it may just up their bounty like an insane amount. I guess just Luffy's bounty since he's the one that did it. Now they see how crazy Luffy actually is. A Navy Admiral is going to come here with a warship. What? Zoro was going to anyways. An Admiral? Oh my God, it's going to be Sengoku. Oh wait, no, he's the... Wait. Oh, he's the fleet admiral. No, he said a navy admiral. That'd be like, oh my god, if it's Aokiji, bro. If it's Aokiji, he'd be like, ah, classic straw hats. Is that just automatic? It's kind of like a buster call, but with an admiral, not vice admirals. Does one admiral on a ship equal that of five? You think that's gonna do anything? Please. Lawn kid are just stone cold. Yeah, what kind of gun even is that? Oh my god, Sanji's getting involved! Just mess him up, dude. You might as well. You've broken the window, now just jump through. But she still has the collar on. Where's the key? They don't look like that big of a deal. Oh wait, Rayleigh. Where is he? Is he still in the cage? And the giant. Oh yeah, they're chilling. <laughs> like, why is he here? Oh, he's out of alcohol. Oh. Oh, shoot. Oh, my gosh. Things are, these are hype, man. Just the, the, the severity of the situation, especially with this, like how they built up the celestial dragons. Oh, gosh. Hatsumaki? Oh, that was dope. Frankie! <laughs> so strong right is the hook. Or not the hook. I see blitz hook. Strong left is like the gun, I'm guessing, I think. Oh, man. Now, how fast will news get out to the Navy, though? And like I said, Luffy still hasn't found out about the whole thing with Ace. There's a lot of developments right now. Oh, my gosh. Brother, they know what they're doing. I'm so easy, man. It's just, uh, it's just, it's disgusting. All men are the same. Every man wants the same. <laughs> Yeah, these guys are nothing, bro. And they're also really close to Navy HQ, too. I really do hope it's Aokiji. I think that would add a very interesting mix because he seemed to sort of take a liking to them and Robin, considering he was there at the very end of Water 7 and any Slobby. Oh, there he goes. Oh, shoot. Oh, my God. I never even realized Usopp hadn't made it. And they were the first to find out. There's no way. Panties guy. Oh, wait. Yeah, Robin and Brooke, too. Oh, my gosh. Wait, they're so out of the loop. They're missing the absolute madness occurring. Usopp, no. What are you doing? Ay, ay, ay. My goodness. Oh, thank you, Robin. Usopp was literally about to perish. Oh. Oh, we got some Marines already here. Oh, my gosh. 
Wait, there's no way an admiral's already here, right? I can't tell if that's an admiral jacket or not. <gasps> really? Oh, he's got berries. He just jacked them. Bro just pickpocketed that man. It'd be hard to pickpocket a bag like that too. I did warn you. We cut it, but a clean cut. Now, where's the key? That's the big question here. And where is Israeli in here? How does he play a part in this? Chopper's treating him. He's hard at work. <laughs> I was waiting. Why does he just say straw hat ya? Yeah, higher than yours. Only one that's higher is kids. Oh my gosh. I like how they get this is like their introduction to him is this absolute chaos. And knowing how he does not care about the circumstances. Fly him in, boys. Oh, wait, they actually okay, yeah, they just yep, right in. Yep, nope, not wasting any time. The straw hats are flashy. Oh, the wings are back! Brooks just has a natural soft landing. Oh, wow, I spoke way too soon. <laughs> uh, Chopper just slides in with milk. He stays strapped, baby. Viva Calcium! That guy just wants his money, bro. I think it's a little bit too late for that. The man himself has arrived. The main character. Oh my gosh. Get in there, bud. Someone's going to kick him in. Uh, uh, there you go. Oh my God, he's going to land on him. Oh my goodness. <gasps> Broke his glasses too. Brother. Dude. Their bounties are like, they, they have to shoot up from this. this. I feel like this is almost like equal in terms of crime to any slobby. That's like the vibes I get from the Celestial Dragons. Straw hat, yeah. Mugiwara, yeah. Is a bear? Oh, he blushed. <laughs> oh, gosh. Wait, so they already... Yeah, they were here. I knew they had a post, but I didn't think an admiral would be there. There's only three admirals, bro. Dude, Lawn Kid here throws a, such wrench, a wrench into the mix, too. And killer. Yeah, for real. That's just crazy. Mugiwara ya crew. <laughs> That's a cool name. Trafalgar. The bear, too? <laughs> Oh, he didn't blush that time. Just gonna point out kid. Eustace, Captain Kid. God, his character design is so cool. He looks like a villain, if I'm being honest, which I guess he could be opposition to Luffy. It's like a rivalry sense, but at least he's a pirate. Ain't no way. Surely someone stops her. You're really asking a celestial dragon to stop? Yeah, bold, man. Oh, oh okay. Well, that's what he gets. He's on their side. He kind of deserves it. They're all ready. To make a move. What do you mean? Frankie has a gun! <gasps> Rayleigh! Oh, the hockey energy! It was the same sound effect. It had to be Rayleigh. Dude, that's so OP. Oh, he, did, he protected her twice. And he's in here, right? Is he just vibing in here? <gasps> oh, shoot. And the giant! What an entrance! Oh my gosh! They don't know who he is, though. I don't think they will know. Unless he's, like, really well known. It seems he is by the Navy, but just his aura would be... Dude. Chills. He just wanted to steal some money to go gamble? <laughs> he's probably like, wow, this has turned different. Is he not concerned about anything happening? Good laugh. Great laugh. Laugh review. I'd give him like a 8.1 out of 10. Good laugh. What if he introduces himself? What would they say? Clearly he, his face isn't known because nobody really reacted. Wait, I didn't realize that. Yeah, where are their callers? He knows! Oh, wait. Oh, yeah, he already did know who he was. He knows his name, but I don't think he knows who he actually is. Oh, he's protective of Hachan. He's stroking his beard. I feel so safe with Rayleigh, I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> Just everybody's in the middle of this. He's putting the pieces together. He's like, hmm, I see, I see, he is. I mean, he must know how big of a deal celestial dragons are. I honestly thought he was gonna say the complete wrong thing. Yeah, bring on the money. Oh, 
dude whatever this hockey energy thing is that is so op that is so broken like dog what a beast oh i saw him realize it he just flexed to another level oh shoot suits dauntless men wait what oh shoot he been waiting to meet him our boy the future king of the pirates dude this is madness i'm so hyped though like there's so many moving pieces an admiral coming rayleigh being a part of the picture who just showed up randomly a couple episodes ago it's hype episode 398 let's go about to be like a war here bro <laughs> look at his head is big kid law and killer oh shoot oh, i forgot his name they're going to fish man yeah they're they're skipping town i don't blame them oh, i forgot her name oh i'm on it's on the tip of my tongue jewelry bonnie jewelry bonnie oh yeah she's like oh zoro's dumb luffy's even dumber oh there's the mad monk bro's always got that crazy smile he's kind of like impressed though there's x drake break skipping town too yeah which admiral is it either it's gonna be aokiji or a new one we haven't even met the other two they said their names uh akainu and kizaru mm, he's gonna stick around apu like the madness it seems like there's one like really close oh captain hawkins who's the one like the with the tarot cards right yeah oh he's safe it's in the cards <gasps> marie joy they're gonna get word about it probably oh sengoku <laughs> what's with that bloodline <laughs> dragon and ace bro i guess and garp five more rookies with over 100 million oh shoot the human shop oh i mean appointment they are so shameless what is this suit oh my gosh violent unprecedented you're so shameless talking about talking corners around a human trafficking who is this Kiza, wait oh oh another admiral this is this is one going oh i thought one was already there oh shoot we get to see another at oh my god gosh dude oh my goodness gracious so now the only one we have him as a kainu so aokiji and kizaru kizaru yeah kizaru i just bent the bars oh oh that seems easy oh disco's office who's laughing oh the owner what don't flamingo owns this but oh my goodness gracious that is and he's laughing about the place being destroyed no shot back what it's not his it's not his problem anymore <laughs> that is crazy he owns it new era draws ever closer oh shoot giving the warlords oh man what is he in hawaii bro's just chilling on a beach oh man that's the war he sounds hype about it too the warlords versus the white beard pirates trying to get ace back oh gosh it'll be madness is Whitebeard ready i mean he still has like all those like the, the machine i guess the machines aren't really on him anymore from what we last saw Oh, he's gonna take the collar off. He got his off. Dude, shout out Rayleigh. Luffy, just, they, they all saw what he did. They all have sense for his energy. I want to see the reactions of finding out who he actually is, especially Luffy's reaction to finding out who he actually is. Ain't nobody need no key. Oh my gosh. How does he get it off? Well, it's different. Mm -hmm. I mean, I don't completely blame them for not wanting to trust a stranger. I mean, he got his off. Oh, is he just gonna nullify the bomb? Trust, trust. They're just like intrigued to see what happens. Oh, oh, but it's gonna be off. It's already gonna be off. I actually can't believe he found the keys. She's free. Open your eyes, Papagoo. It's gone. Dude, how? What are his powers? 
<laughs> Bro, like the the fact that they're standing in the room with him is just bonkers. Like it's crazy. Now they know you really built different. Aww. He fell over himself. My heart. <laughs> oh. Is he not gonna introduce himself? I guess he doesn't have a care to. He doesn't seem like the type to flex who he is. He's got a gnarly scar though. I feel like Luffy's got a gut feeling about what's going on too, or, or like just the fact that he's in the room with someone very important. I mean, I guess it's kind of like context clues with the power that he just used, but still, I think Luffy, uh, I don't know, just like a an, an, an instinct. Oh, can we actually see what happened? Ooh, he took it off and sent it away. So it actually did blow up. He just moved it. Let's go. Everybody's free. Even discount Blackbeard. Then what happens when the Admiral gets here? Yeah, he did. Actually, I should have thought I should have suits Dauntless men. Is he talking about Shanks? Because he got the hat from Shanks. What does Dauntless even mean? Oh, he knows what hockey is. Kind of just seems like a, a psychic energy. I didn't realize other pirates were watching. Mm -hmm. Says the big shot. He knows. Oh man. Race on disguise. Mm. He's retired. I like how he calls them fellows. Yeah. <laughs> Oh my gosh! Oh my gosh! Release the Roswald family! Uh, how long is it gonna take the Admiral to get there? The three rookies. He wants to see more! Yeah, dude. He's the one I have to flex on him. Mm. It seems the Navy already has. Go on ahead? Like he's gonna fight through? Oh, by himself. All right, kid, go flex. Go flex. Oh, no, they're all getting ego about it. Look at the three of them. <laughs> I mean, in terms of power, I'm assuming kid's stronger than Luffy and Luffy's stronger than Law. That's a cool shot. Now, Law's blade is so long. Like, it's way too long for his size. Honestly, I thought his name was cheesy at first. It kind of goes hard. I don't even like Eustace Captain Kid. They're all ego about it. He's gonna be okay. Chopper's got him all bandaged up. It's nobody's fault, guys. Come on. Frankie's like, can you not like breathe so close to me? <laughs> He's turning his head back and forth. Oh yeah, Luffy told him not to blame himself. Trying to live. Meet on Grove 13. Is that where his shop is? <laughs> Aww. Oh, they're like a new family. That's so wholesome. Aww. Hell yeah. Now they're friends with three giants. Oh, I guess five giants. The two from, from Little Garden and the two from Innis Lobby. Wait, did they make it? Do they live? On Innis Lobby? It's One Piece. They probably live. Wait, yeah. These Navy men stand no chance. What? Yo, um, uh, Law, Law's bounty seems a little low. I'm gonna be honest. What was that? Bro just decapitated that man, but he's still alive. It's like he turned them into buggy. What was that? I want to see why Kid has such an insane bounty aside, uh, uh, like, next to Luffy's. He, like, repelled it. It looked like electricity, too. What kind of weird power is that? Says you! <laughs> Even the head? Oh, gosh. Dude, Law's power is weird. He, like, swapped the places of the cannonball on the guy's head, but also decapitated the guy. Come on, let Kid and Law fight more. <gasps> the hat saved. It is electricity. Oh, it's like the force. Oh, my gosh. Wait, is he going to just make a big ball? Oh my gosh, wait, that's sick. I wonder what he did to get his bounty too. I have to think about that. Like Luffy, like they went to any lobby and did that. They've taken out warlords. They've taken down warlords and he and his bounty is higher than Luffy's. Like he has to have done crazy stuff. They said he hurts citizens, but it has to be like an insane amount. 
true. I don't know. Laws was the most confusing. Luffy's is pretty straightforward. He just stretches. I guess that's because we're used to it, though. God dang, though. How sick is this, man? These three insane pirates fighting side by side. Okay, wait. I want to replay. Uh, I, I, I kind of understand kids, I think. his. Is, I think his power seems pretty straightforward. But Laws, I have... So he says room. It makes an aura. So he, like, I guess he creates a room with someone. He like, d designates an area of effect and then cuts the guy's head off. I guess a cannonball comes in while he's doing that. Shambles switches the, their places. Oh, the cannon was headed towards him. He swapped places with it so that it would sit right there and explode and he would get the head. So from what I gather, he is able to control a certain area, manipulate even body parts and control by like teleporting. And that's without even unsheathing his blade. Maybe it's just a regular blade, who knows? But that is an absurd power. But God dang, do I love these, ep wait, but by the way, this is a death on his hands. That is so metal. I love these episodes where we get to see people really flex, especially going into the new world and being on, in this island where we're going to see these rookies. It is so cool to see what Luffy is kind of matched up against in terms of bounties and whatnot. It kind of puts everything in the perspective too, but like just everything with with Rayleigh and, and, and trying to find out why he's here, his power, the hockey energy. The show is just on fire right now. I thought it would kind of like slow down. I mean, people say the Royal Bark was slow, but I thought the Royal Bark kept the pace up. It went into the entire thing with kuma and then this is just it's just like rolling into you and we're about we're next next video next time i watch we'll hit 400 which is insane and we won't even be halfway through the show yet and quite possibly this may not even be a third of the way through the show yet once the show finishes i think the time i'm recording this it's at like a thousand fifty or something i don't really know a thousand thirty thousand twenty and if the show keeps going this is probably around a third of the way through if that it's just crazy man i i am so in love with one piece but guys that's been it for episodes 397 397 98 of a one piece watch through if you're new to the channel don't forget to drop a sub it's never too late and i'll catch you in the next one peace peace